Hi there, I'm Kathleen McGivern and I'm Dessertastic and it is almost Christmas, my lovely friend. So welcome to Drawing with Littles where we create drawings for everybody of all ages. So make sure that you grab your choice of art making mediums and colors and join me because today in this episode we're drawing the special person who comes around at night to deliver some presents and that of course is Santa Claus. So we're going to be drawing a portrait, so that means a picture of someone's face is a portrait and we're going to be drawing a portrait of Santa Claus. So make sure that you hit that subscribe button for this channel so you get weekly drawing with little videos and grab those art making mediums oh, and I wonder if you remember what I'm gonna say. Oh yeah, all artists say this. Let's make some art. All right, we're gonna draw Santa. So we're gonna start off with Curving lines to make the brim of a Santa hat. Draw one big curving line up and another curving line and create the tip of the hat with some curving lines to create a nice fluffy pom pom on the end there. Draw two lines down for Santa's face. And then we're gonna give Santa a very big beard with some big curving lines. Draw curves or letter C's on either side of the head with little ones on the inside to make some Santa ears. In the middle of the face, give Santa a nose with a curving line or a backwards letter C. We're going to draw curves to make Santa's eyes. That way he looks super happy. And of course he is because he's been waiting for this Christmas day to come for a year. We're gonna give Santa a mouth in his beard. So we're gonna draw a nice curving line to make a little smiley. And I like to add little curves on the corners of the mouth to make it look extra happy. And just like that, we're ready to color. Hmm, what color should we color in Santa's hat, I wonder? Oh yeah, red. Santa does have a nice red hat. So let's grab our red and we're going to color it in. We're gonna be careful to keep the red off of the fluffy white. And then we're gonna color it in nice and dark to make sure there's no white on the red. Cause if we leave it like this, that doesn't quite look like Santa's hat. So we're gonna make sure that we make it look like Santa's hat by coloring it in. Just like that. Hmm. Well, now we need to color in Santa's face. And you can grab whatever, whatever color, skin color you want to color in Santa's face. The choice is yours. So you can grab your choice of skin color to color in your Santa's face. I'm going to grab a gray and I'm going to use gray to shade my Santa hat. I'm going to add gray along the bottom of the hat, gray around his nose and under his mouth, and gray on the pom-pom. 
and under the beard. And this is like a shadow. So if I hold my hand over the paper, I have a big light to my left. So it's making that top of my hand nice and bright. But on the opposite side of a light, we get a shadow. You'll notice that when you go outside, the sun's above you, so it's nice and bright above, but below is a shadow. And we're making shadows on our Santa. The light's coming this way, so it has nice highlights, but underneath is a shadow. And we can use all kinds of colors to add shadows. You could use blue to add a shadow or purple. In this case, I'm just using a little bit of gray. And just like that, our jolly Saint Nick Santa Claus is done. I'm Ms. Artastic, and that's the end of this episode. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button. And for more art lessons, 100 exclusive art lessons, make sure that you check out my course, 100 Cartoons for Kids. The link is in the description of this video, and it's 100 exclusive drawing tutorials, premium drawing tutorials for kids. You can use it as a course for at home if you're a kid. You can follow along with any medium or if you're a teacher, you can use it as your directed drawing program in your classroom for obviously an entire year because you have 100 drawing videos to choose from for your classroom. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, like this video and comment with ideas for things that you want me to draw in future drawing tutorials. I'm always open for ideas. So comment with things that you want me to draw and let's make some art.